Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play System Shock. Last time, we cleared out the engineering level and successfully destroyed the four antenna relays, stopping Shodan's plan to download herself on the Earth's network. After that, we received authorization to scuttle Citadel Station in its entirety. So, we're headed to the reactor level to set it to self-destruct, but we need to get the final piece of the system's authorization code, which is housed on the flight deck, level 5. Another thing is the group of survivors we've heard from. We, they contacted us when we left level 2, and again when we arrived on level 5. We haven't investigated them yet or tried to help them, so we'll do that too. Let's get started. We are still at risk. Oh yes, and a note about monsters. The remaining levels that I haven't cleared yet, level 5, level 8, and level 9, I'm pleased to say don't feature respawn at all. So I can kill everything without any worries. Which is a big relief in my world. Destroy the camera. Security is down to 95%. And already there's a door. I hear a zero. <gasps> Gonna say I heard a zero G mutant, and indeed there it is. Another camera. Security's down to 91%. Alright, let's have a look in here. Phone. Alright, let's listen to this log. Diego, April 27th, 2072. Oscar, guess what? I'm under investigation, so shred what you've got. Shred it all. Got that? Now get this. The logs of the experiments are protected by some program called Showdown. So I picked up some hacker who's gonna crack it for us. That gives me access to the robos and the other systems on the station. So we've got a shield if they try and dust me. Sit tight, baby. It's under control. Alright. Corpse has nothing. Debris. Another camera. Security's down to 86%. There's a He's got a hollow tip 2100 clip, an AM Hornet clip. Crady Destroyed had two battery packs in it. Ever since I've... Ever since discovering I could destroy things, I kind of like doing it. Which, on the one hand, is silly, but... Lump of cores. And here is another log. Kel, September 15th, 2072. For some reason, the cyborgs are patrolling the access quarters around Flight Bay 4. What are they guarding there, anyhow? Here's another camera. Level security is now 82%. Down here. Turbo Motion Booster System V2, which I already had. Another camera. Security's down to 78%. Nothing on that corpse. that corpse. A bulkhead door, which 
I have no doubt we have to solve that puzzle to open. I'll go ahead and solve the puzzle, even though I don't want to go through the door yet, but before I do that, let's destroy this second camera back here. Drop level security to 73%. Oh, a grid puzzle. Alright, let's check out the... Okay. So the side effect is that everything adjacent gets powered off. Or gets changed, I should say. Got it. And then something on the other side of the... Well, I solved the puzzle. And was promptly slaughtered by something on the other side of the door. So perhaps... I should... take a look at my health. <laughs> and... Realizing how low it is. Make a healing run. I could run up to level 7, but... That surgery machine is, I believe at least, harder to get to. Back this way. Now let's solve the puzzle again. on my lantern so I can see just what I'm dealing with. Well, or alternatively, let's just close the bulkhead and be content in the knowledge that the puzzle is solved and I can open it. Flight bays two and three. Severed head. Let's get rid of it. I don't like severed heads. They're not aesthetically pleasing to me. There's a security one bot. Let's take it out with the mag pulse. We should just use the laser rape here. I mean, I get nervous 
just because I haven't found this area's re resurrection station yet, but we got destroyed by an assassin that time. Security's down to 69% after I destroy that camera. Destroyed the assassin. Destroy that camera. Drop security to 65%. Yes, I'll pick up the first aid kit. Thank you. Immediate full health? How could I say no to that? Well, the security one bot has wandered somewhere, which is fine. Let's see what else we've got over here. Gray. Interesting. You are not welcomed here. Remove yourself. It's another iris door with a puzzle to solve. I have little doubt the compute the computer nodes are back there. All right, let's check this one out. Same thing, it flips all of the adjacent switches. So that closed for now. You know me, I like to explore contained areas without opening doors. So let's head down here. Cyborg conversion cancelled. Standard station restoration procedures online. Glorious! Well, that stops any end of... stops any and all worrying about health. There's the security one bot. It's got an AM Hornet clip. Well, I got gunned down by another security one bot, judging by the sound. This level is very easy. I think they expected you to come here as soon as you heard from the survivors. There he is. Security one bot and the maintenance bot will destroy both, of course. Alright, let's look over here now. Moderate biocontamination, thanks to our level 3 Enviro suit. So there's an AM splinter clip, and an AM hornet clip, and a log. Travers, September 1st, 2072. Son of a... Service bridge in Flight Bay 4 has blown a couple of fuses. We're getting up something temporary, but it's gonna be a little fidgety. Gunned down again. Oh well. <laughs> there he 
there's the security one bot. He's got a Teflon pistol clip and Mark III magnesium tip shells. Yet another one with Mark III magnesium tip shells. Now as we come back here... I find the computer node, which is what I technically came for, so let's destroy it. Level security drops to 21%, and I get the last digit of the system's authorization code, which is zero. So if you'll be kind enough to give me just a minute to jot that down. So, my system's authorization code is 565906. That's going from level 1 through level 6. But remember, those numbers are randomized. You will need to pay attention yourself if you play this game. The numbers are not the same. I wonder... Can I destroy these? I can. That cord says nothing. This room has target identifier V2, which is obsolete. All right. I do like destroying things, even though it doesn't actually get rid of the biocontamination. Now we can head up here. Another security one bot. It's got an AM Hornet clip. And there's a first aid kit. Just gonna leave it where it is. <gasps> Cyborg Assassin has nothing. That looks to be a flight bay. There's another cyborg assassin with a standard pistol clip. And I've arrived on the other end of that handy ladder. Here's a human corpse with nothing on it. And there we got gunned down by something. I don't know what. Probably an assassin, since it was silent. There's what I was looking for. Yes. <gasps> All right. That assassin had a standard pistol clip. And that looks like another overlook. 
but there is a ladder. Good. Great had nothing in it. The assassin has some needle darts, so good for him. Here are two cameras, level security down to 17% and 13%. And there's a new log. McDan, October 12th. October 12th, 2072. We're all still reeling from the disaster two days ago. I checked out the defense system, but there's not a thing wrong with it. Well, unless you count that it fired on our own shuttle. I'm taking it offline today. In this crate, we have two EMP grenades. Obviously good. This one has a meta patch. Obviously, I want that too. And we've closed the loop. So let's head this way now. Got a blast door there. Flight Bay 4. The corpse with nothing. Alright. Hidden door. Another charging station, a Mark III assault rifle, and magnesium tip shells. Cyborg Warrior, hanging out around the corner, has an AM splinter clip, and Teflon coated rounds. I actually can't destroy the cart. There's a concussion bomb, a soda, and a meta patch healing agent. All right. <clears throat> it's finally time to open some doors. Open the executive door here. Step. I hate it when I die because it cuts Shodan off. The first word was step, and then she stopped talking. How sad. <laughs> There's a robot up there with two hollow tip 2100 clips on it. Let's try this again. I showed it. Alright, if we try it. Well, hopefully this time we won't get tagged on our way up. Alright, I got one good swing in. Let's just keep going. Same thing. 
Alright, that one's got nothing. That one's got a Teflon coated pistol clip. I got one good hit in on the third one. got nothing either. Okay, good. These are just screens for looking at the flight bays, I guess. Here's a log. Shodan, October 11th, 2072. Cyborg 65V, you have been selected to keep all robots, cyborgs, and mutants away from Beta Girl. On the executive level, no one may enter while my experiments there are in progress. And be certain that none of the lucky subjects escape. We haven't had one of these in a while, but there's a cyberspace terminal. Let's check it out now. That wear is obsolete. Discarded. Alright, let's destroy the cyber guards first with my pulser. My awesome V8 pulser. That wear is obsolete. Discarded. more big bad guys. Drill V4. Alright. Let's handle some ice defenses now. Integrity failure imminent. That wear is obsolete. Discarded. Where's the exit? There it is. Flight Bay Armory unlocked. Okay. Well, we did open the armory with the switching node. Might as well loot it. We've got two hollow tip 2100 clips. A mag pulse cartridge, a landmine, a meta patch, and two concussion bombs. Alright, since I actually managed to exit normally, I shouldn't have any time penalties. Let's head back in. There's another switching node. Bay door number three unlocked. Good. Now I do have drill version 4, which I can only imagine is a good thing. That wear is obsolete. Discarded. Bot Bounce Games Software acquired. And that's it. I think we're done in here. There's an exit. Okay, good. So that was, I have to admit, a very easy cyberspace terminal. Now here's Flight Bay 3, which we just managed to unlock in cyberspace. So let's head in. Magnum 2100, 
human corpse with a soda can. had nothing, the corpse has nothing, there's another winged mutant. Nothing. Human corpse. Nothing. And some crates. Nothing. 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 And more corpses. Nothing. Nothing. Soda. Nothing in the crate. There's a metapat. Nothing on the corpse, but there's a log from Kel, October 8th. 2072. These crates give us good position, but I don't see a way to break through the life pods. Beth and Imran, see if you can get down to where it says Flight Bay 2. Uh oh. Nothing in that crate, and nothing on that corpse. Doesn't seem to be a good way back up there, either. Uh, let's head through this iris door. And see what we find. Keypad unlocks door. Rebecca gave me these codes, didn't she? I think she did. Let's check my email. Listen to her again. Listen up, Hacker. I finally convinced the Browser Trioptimum to let us blow the station. If you could find out the system's authorization code, you can send the reactor to overload. Look for that code from Will and Richie, the sysop on engineering. Then you have to go to the reactor core and look for a panel where you can enter the code and hit the overload switch. You'll need at least a level 2 environment suit to survive, or else a hell of a lot of detox. Escape pods are on the flight deck. Enter and launch code is 001. Good luck! Non-emergency. Life pods disabled. Okay. Non-emergency. Life pods disabled. Well, I can't get in there anyway, but I was right. She gave me the code. Whenever I do need it, the code is 001. Let's destroy these things. <laughs> that one's got nothing. That corpse has got nothing. My lantern has been on this whole time, which explains why my energy has been depleting. My laser rapier is apparently out of juice. So I'm gonna have to kill that guy with something else. Let's go back and juice it up right quick. Is this another copy of the same puzzle? Is that what's happening here? Yes. Anyway, that was easy enough to deal with. Get juiced. Now let's check out this guy. A 
A lot of corpses, none of them carrying anything. Except soda. I guess they were caffeine addicts too. Good for them. Bones. Big crate with nothing inside. Let's get up here. With my jump jets. <laughs> Cyborg warrior, empty crate, and I'm back at this little bulkhead. There's a light switch too. Not that I needed it, but... Okay. One flight bay I haven't checked out, the door marked gray, and another executive door over there. Let's check out the door that says gray. Gray, gray. What is this? Got, rep got a repulsor here. There's another flyer mutant. Still seeing the word gray. Coupled with more repulsors, which is fine. Resist. I'm afraid it's too late to save your friend. There's something we haven't seen before. A Cortex Reaver. And... No real surprise there. It gunned me down. Let's try and juice up before we go. Alright, guess I'll go to the other power station. Since I'm over here, I'll check out Flight Base. <laughs> Auto bomb. Soda, a law. Travers, October 11th, 2072. All flight bay maintenance personnel, we have a serious emergency. Yesterday, the defense system fired without executive control and blew a triop shuttle right out of the hangar. I want a complete diagnostic on the computer node in the South Repair Center. If you find anything funny, take it offline. Alright, <clears throat> over here there's a meta patch. And another one of these rooms. Here's the sort of overlook of that flight bay.
Nothing. Nothing. Nothing on the corpse. What do these buttons do? Force bridges? Okay. Well, rather than solve the puzzle the way we're supposed to, I think I'll just use my jump jets to get to the end point. There's a bulkhead door. Hmm. There's a log. McDan, October 13th, 2072. Don Travers had me examining defense relays all morning. Seems there was a signal from Shodan 78 milliseconds before they fired. So I went down to disconnect the CPU node, and a malfunctioning maintenance bot almost killed me. This whole thing is getting stranger by the minute. Alright, let's see if my jump jets can get me up there in time. Close. And that's a negative, unfortunately. Good news is I can activate this repulsor. And get back to the power station. And try it again. Let's get up here first. Another power station. Illudium cadmium batteries and a standard battery. Oh, and a force bridge over to there. Good. Cool. Okay, let's try the force bridge. Let's see what's over here. A hollow tip 2100 clip, a first aid kit, debris. Head mounted lantern V2, debris. And V1 jump jets, which get discarded. Awesome. Okay, that just about covers it for over here. We just need to see what's through here. Through this other repulsor room. Up there at the top. Get in there, dude. Get in there, dude. There we go. There's a security 
Security one bot with an AM splinter clip and Teflon coated pistol bullets. A first aid kit, a reflex patch, a detox patch, two EMP grenades, and a landmine. All right, let me peek at my map. That leaves. The Cortex Reaver, and one other door by the elevator we haven't checked out yet. And that's it. Oh, but there's another room out of here, which we will need to examine. Come on, homie. You can do it. Get in there. Got it. There's security one bot. Come on, Holmes. Damn it. <coughs> I was worried I'd have to make the stupid repulsor jump again, and so I shall. Before I do, though, let's check out this last executive door. <laughs> Warrior Cyborg. That's fine. Corpse with two soda cans. Here's a log. Schuler, August 4th, 2072. Internal security report. Subject, Edward Diego. We're gonna nail this guy to the wall. I am now working as his personal secretary, and I've already found signs of a cover-up in C-Space. Nothing relating to mutagen research, but I'm looking. This thing is big. <laughs> Another log. Travers, September 11th, 2072. Security bot went bananas in the convection shaft. Had to toss in an EMP grenade. Huh. Anyways, the bearings in the northeast convection shaft are shot. I left the repulsors on for the maintenance people. That's it for today. Found a Teflon-coated pistol clip. <laughs> Cyborg Assassin has a standard pistol clip. None of these corpses seem to have anything. Okay. Oh, and there's some Trank darts. Good. Alright. Well, let's go back. Pulsers. Pain in the butt that they are. There we go. Got the security bot. Mag pulse cartridge. ER90 blaster. And a version 2 shield. this blaster. An energy weapon. Almost certainly not as strong as the ion rifle. So, let's get the laser rapier back. Alright, let's get out of here. Well, shoot, all that's left now, I think, is the Cortex Reaver. Oh, wait. There's still that central room, too. I need to go check out. Check out. 
I can only get to through here. So let's check it out. Well, there was a cyborg assassin up there. Got a blast door. He's got some trank darts for me. Ah, oh, yes. The blast door. How could I forget? Creep over here now. Got a repulsor lift here. A log. Travers, August 25th, 2072. Al, we need to replace the first aid kits in the life pods for flight bees 2 and 3. Oh, and run a diagnostic on the jettison controls. Destroy that camera, level security's down to 8%. Guess I have to shoot the last camera. That's fine. Well, it's not the last camera. Level security's down to 4%. And I've got a puzzle to solve. Alright. Okay, now we need to get the colors right.
There we go. All that did was extend a force bridge. All that work for virtually nothing. Oh well. Let's open this up. This is the freight elevator. Good. Now, there's truly nothing left save the big bad Cortex Reaver. Let's go deal with it. Two whacks with the laser rapier weren't enough. But we got him in. on that one. Nothing. 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 Helmet. Nothing. Spark beam and a soda. Okay, I'll have to check that out in a s just a second. Oh, okay, it just takes me up here. Oh, now I'll have to loop back around. Oh well, that isn't hard. That's just a handy way out. Check this office looking room. Nothing. Just a wrapper. And the, the storage room. Got an assault rifle. One, two, three landmines. The corpse itself has nothing. A V2 target identifier is obsolete. Heavy slug 2100 clip, hollow tip 2100 clip, DC rubber slugs, and a log. Parofsky, November 6th, 2072. That's the woman who emailed us before we got here. I wonder if you'll hear this, Hacker. Albert Bryson and I were the only ones who survived the last attack. We, um, we hid. Shuttered has another plan. It's going to load itself into Earth's computer net. We will be dead in another minute. Can't let them take us. Alright. Well, so much for finding friends. Where's the last camera? Must be through the uh, escape pod doors. Anyway, we've fully explored the flight deck. And we've got what we came for, the last piece of the system's authorization code. 
But with that in hand, let's get back to the elevator and make our way down to the reactor level. Things are going to get exciting. All right, let's do this. I'm going to hit the surgery machine. And now we need to head to the reactor core. Finally, after all this time. Let me pull up the my system's authorization code. You see these The gratings are open now. So let's turn on the repulsor. Pulls me up here. Reactor overload fuse control. Okay, we need to enter the code. I have five, six, five, nine, zero, six. Destruct security clearance. Accepted. Reactor destruct. Countdown started. That's that. I have no idea where the red where the last 20% level security is. Guess it doesn't matter too much. So I've got that done, which is good. Sorry, I'm just on my laptop. Juggling documents. I guess it doesn't really matter, but I'd like to kill everything too, so. Six hoppers have spawned in the corridors. I've killed two of them. I'd like to find the other four. Since I set the reactor to destruct. a security two bot. Three of those have spawned in. <clears throat> Shodan's not happy with us. trying to search the bodies, and I got gunned down. There was a mutated cyborg. Destroyed him too.
bot, the last Security 2 bot. Get that hopper now. Alright. The mutated cyborg dropped Mark III penetrator shells and a railgun clip. Now let's look at all the Security 2 bots. I found a Hollow Tip 2100 clip, a Heavy Slug 2100 clip, and another Heavy Slug and another Hollow Tip 2100 clip. Cool. I want to destroy those hoppers just because, you know, completionist. I also really want to know where that last 20% level security is hiding. <laughs> When I left, I assumed it was in the reactor core. That's obviously not the case. I guess it doesn't really matter, but still. It's crazy. Hmm. Oh well. It really doesn't matter, so we can, we can just get out of here. Alright. Security 2 bots. It's all good. <laughs> that one dropped Mark 3 Mega Tip shells. And it looks like we've got a few more. Again, not really a problem. I can just zerg him with my laser rapier. Nothing. Heavy Slug 2100 clip. Heavy Slug 2100 clip. And nothing. Alright. Let's head up to level 3. Where 10 Security 2 bots have spawned in. <laughs> Six. 
six. Alright, let's check these guys out now. Nothing. 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 Heavy Slug 2100 clip. Alright, there are six more. You know, somewhere. I figured we'd run into them if we tried for the elevator. Five. Four. Two heavy slug 2100 clips. That's awesome. Hollow tip 2100 clips. Three. He's got nothing. And I don't really care about the others. Let's head. Or no. Let's take the freight elevator and head to level five. Oh. Because we're headed to the escape pods, right? Right. Of course not, but you know, we'll try. Twenty one hundred clip and nothing. Let's head into the freight elevator. New mail Edward Diego. Don't keep me waiting, hacker. I am eager to finish what I started. There are security two bots on this deck as well. <laughs> oh, you knew they were going to be there, but even so. If I get one good hit, I'm making progress. We're going to zerg while we still can, because this is the last video where zerging is a possibility. Goodness. 
Got one. Got three, got four. Do a few left spins just because. Eventually, if you turn too far in one direction. For me, at least, my mouse kind of locks up. Got five, alright. Hollow tip 2100 clip. Mark three magnesium tip shells, hollow tip 2100 clip. Mark three magnesium tip shells. Mark three penetrator shells, heavy slug 2100 clip, and nothing. There's Diego. Remember, he teleported away the first time we saw him, so... We'll zerk him, since we can. And he teleports away again. Double O one. Opens up the escape pods. Got a first aid kit inside this one. And in this one. Same deal, so let's just choose one. Let's hit the emergency level. Live pod launch initiated. Escape pod launch. Countdown. You have destroyed my beautiful spaceship. You will not escape now. I am departing. But you shall remain to die. Of course Shodan doesn't let us go. We've got an email from Shodan, too. You have had destroyed my beautiful spaceship. You will not escape now. I am departing, but you shall remain to die. We've got a mail from Rebecca now, too. I see that you are still receiving transmissions from Earth. We'll have no more of that. Alright. <clears throat> ah yes, more Security 2 bots, naturally. So we have to get to the bridge. Level 9. That requires us to go through level 8. I want to destroy the security bots in the other bay.
Let's charge up before we head back again. Got two. I think there are three more. Three, I'm counting two more. Got four, let's get the Alright. Heavy slug twenty one hundred clip. Hollow tip twenty one hundred clip. Heavy Slug 2100 clip. Hollow Tip 2100 clip. And two Hollow Tip 2100 clips. Alright. Onward. we can get back this way. Alright, we'll take the executive elevator back to level 6. a little and we'll head to the engineering level from Diego's little shrine Exploded. I'm not sure what. Doesn't matter. Let's make our way back to the top level. Magnesium tip shells, heavy slug 2100 clip. They've destroyed my surgery machine. Bastards. I think what actually happened is they triggered the landmines. Let's at least juice up at the power station.
naturally. More security to bots. station still charging. Alright. I need to be a little more clever in how I deal with these guys. Clearly. I think they're mutated cyborgs here by the elevator. Yes. We've got another email. Rebecca Six. God damn it! I thought we had Shonen's jamming signal beat. Boris is working on it. We've got some information. You'll have to cut through the security level to get to the bridge. We're guessing Shonen has disabled most of the Around the central college. You won't be able to do, do you really think your little friend Rebecca can help you? to shoot them. Let's get my mag out. Can I juice up? I doubt it, but I'll try. Oh, I can. Good.
two. He dropped a meta patch. And now I can go to the security level. So let's do that. All right. We've arrived at the security level. So, I am going to call it a video here. And new main save and a beginning of level 8 save. This has been Let's Play System Shock. Just now, we cleared the flight deck, enabled the reactor self-destruct, and tried to escape, but we're blocked, so we're headed to the bridge. I will do that next time. Until then, thank you for watching. Bye-bye.